Hi folks, how you doing? This is Brian Smoke. I'm with ProspectRepeat.com, one of the treasure hunters for ProspectRepeat.com. I'm out here in the lovely state of Missouri off of I-29, off of a rest area, looking for two caches as usual. Uh, we found them. We did pretty good. This is a pre-trip to show you guys what's going on in the 2008 season. Um, old Pete sent me out here to give you guys a little heads up of what's going on. Uh, we're going to have metal detecting this year, geocaching, rock counting, gold panning. Uh, our gold panning trip this year probably going to go back to Colorado. We're going to go to the Buena Vista area. We're also going to go back to the uh, Salida area. going to visit a couple of claims there. We're going to try and find a couple of new claims this year. Uh, for metal detecting, we've got permission to go on a couple of cool places. Uh, one of them is an old coal mine that was shut down in the early 1900s in Kansas. It's a shaft that goes down probably about 725 feet, but as you guys probably know in metal detecting, a lot of the old coal mines had a lot of areas around there where they would actually have little camps. So we're going to see how successful we can be there. We'll show you those videos this year. Um, we're going to do something a little different this year for the kids. It came to our attention there's not a lot of videos out there that actually show child safety in the field. Uh, a lot of you guys out there geocaching and metal detecting and gold panning or hot counting have never really been out in the outdoors and you don't really know what to do in an emergency situation. We're going to help the adults out as well as the kids, but we're really concerned about the kids this year. Um, as you guys know, three children were lost last year. One of them happened to be a Boy Scout. He did really well, but they found all three kids, but it came to our attention that it was really important that children know what to do when they get lost. So we're going to hit on that this year. Um, gold panning, uh, we're going to try out a couple of new uh, devices this year. We're going to have a blue bowl concentrator that we're going to field test. Uh, the Trinity gold panning bowl, that's for my wife. She's going to actually have one of those and let us know how that's going. Um, metal detecting, we're going to try a bunch of new detectors this year. And uh, we've got a new uh, recreational vehicle out there. We bought a Hummer H3 for the company. That's our treasure hunting assault vehicle. We've also bought an RV, which is our treasure hunting base camp for prospectorpeat.com. In case you guys don't know it yet, you need to visit our site and go check out our new, we have art specifically for treasure hunting, for geocaching, gold panning, everything. Uh, we're also one of the largest suppliers of graphics for geocaching, treasure hunting. You guys got to see some of these cool t-shirt graphics that I personally designed. I'm getting a lot of acclaim for it, and I appreciate it if you check it out. So you guys stay tuned. You're going to see some pretty cool stuff. We just came back from Omaha. We were hit and miss on a few geocaches. We didn't get a chance to go gold panning this time, but we're going to check it out again. We're going to start hitting uh, the western country. You guys stay tuned. It's coming up, and enjoy the video. This is our upcoming 2008 season. Keep it in the pan.